waiting, waiting, waiting. I'm always waiting for you guys. Come on, let's get moving. It's aerobic gold style time. I want you to start tapping your toes just like we've been doing. Last 10 minutes we've been waiting for you. Tapping away, but you're here now. So four more, and four, and three, and two. Take the other side, let's go. Tap it down. Now Effie's got a really stylish move on this one. has got those hips going. I, I can't, yeah you can. What do you mean again? We've never done this before. Come on, eight more, <laughs> eight, seven. I'm gonna stick to my one, straight up and down. Four, three, marching right leg, left leg. Here we go, right left, right left. Body's up nice and tall. Have I told you anything about the show? This is aerobics style. I'm Wendy, this is the team. We're gonna be working out today in Hyde Park, as you can tell, Archibald Fountain behind us, dedicated to Australia. It's actually in commemoration of Australia and France getting together in the First World War. You can tell that by just looking at it, can't you? Four and three and two. Take your feet wider. I still told you nothing about what the workout's about. We're going to be doing a warm-up to start with and then it's body conditioning. Now, body conditioning means toning and strengthening exercises for the muscles. Bring it down to that toe tap again. We're going to strengthen the muscles and the choice is going to be up to these guys behind me. They're going to tell me what muscle group they want to work and we're going to think of an exercise together to work the muscles. Upper body, lower body, middle body, anybody's body. Four and three and two, take the other side now. Tap those toes. That's it, your feet are a little bit wider apart. Get ready, we're gonna be going into a squat position after four. One, two, feet out wide, knee bend down. Take it down, up, down, up. Pumping through the legs. Make sure your knees are going out to the side over the toes. Add the arms, squeezing four in front. Three, take it behind now, four times. One, and two, and three. Back down in front, squeeze through your chest, work your shoulders. Take it back, stretching those shoulders. In front, give me circles now. Hands go down and around. Little tiny circles to start with, not too big. Get ready, reverse the circle now, down, over. Bring the hands right over the top. Feel the shoulders, feel the chest. Pump your hands down the middle. Push out, push out. Four more, four, three, get ready. Right and left now, take it. Right and left, little bit of bounce in your step here. Keep it energetic, keep it light. Bend through the knees, four, Three, take one hand up overhead. Here we go. Lift, lift, bring it down and punch. Take it out, four more, four, three. Single arm overhead, let's go. Four, three, two, bring it down. Four, three, one more time, up overhead. Lifting, please take both arms out of here. Woo! Come on, stretch it out, nice and strong. Seven, six, five. Get ready guys, we're going into a step touch right now. Stepping out to the side, stretching out the arms, taking huge steps. Eight more like that. Eight, seven, six, five. Hey, we've got a, a grapevine coming up now. Take it to your right, grapevine. Right arm up, left arm up. Little bit of low impact exercise to warm up the muscles, get the heart rate up. Reach and pull. That's it, four more times the same. Four out, three out, two, one more time. Leg curls again. Bring your arms down low, relax the shoulders just for a moment. Make sure you're bending down through your knees. Four to go. And four, three, back to great finds, reach up. Out and pull. Can you feel your back muscle on this one? Reach and squeeze into your back muscles. One more time each way. Squeeze down, leg curls, here we go. Cross the arms over. Relax the neck, relax the shoulders, work into those legs. Easy walks, guys. Muscle arms now. Hands a little bit higher. Stretch out to the chest every time you really open those arms. Push. Two more times. One more time the same. Marching forward. One, two, three, clap. Move it forward. And back. And again. How far can you travel? Hey guys, come and join me in one line. We're gonna team up here. One great big line. Be careful of those hand weights. Come back just a little bit. That's it. Make sure you're not gonna trip on those ones, Michelle. And again. One more time. Easy walk, push your hands straight up overhead. Push. That's it, not those muscle arms now, I don't think. Reach and pull. Now get the legs all in line. That's it. Keep going, two more. One more, do you guys know a single step knee? Here it comes. Step knee, other side, step knee. That's it, get the knees up, point those toes. Smile, reach those arms out. Woo! Will you stop bumping me? You're such a bully, Janie. <laughs> two more. Keep going, one more. Back to the easy walk, bring the arms down to a bicep curl, guys. Down low, show me the muscles. 
Now this is what we're going to see a little bit later on. We're going to see all of these guys' muscles. We've got body conditioning. We're going to be toning and tightening. So they're going to look fantastic. You're going to feel fantastic. Come straight back after this short break. See you soon. Ready? Hand weights, hand weights, hand weights. If you don't have hand weights available, why not get a couple of cans of baked beans or something you can hold on to nice and comfortable? If you don't have hand weights or anything available, don't even worry about that because some of the exercises won't even involve the hand weights. Let's start off working into the upper body and the legs and then we'll have a talk to everybody about their specific muscle groups. Give me a step touch side to side. Step it out. Oh, oops. Right and left. Great find now. Here we go. Curl it in. Look at the arms. Working through the shoulders, working through the triceps. Stepping out with the heel first. Take the arms even higher now, push it up. Lift, keep that going, going to the left and the right. Stretching the arms right up overhead. Long arms, reaching high. Four more times the same, step it out, four. Pull it down, three, pull it down, two, one more time, okay. Step touch side to side, reach and pull the arms. Keep this one going. Now our holding pattern's always gonna be that grapevine and we come back down to a step touch. Right now I'm gonna pop over to Michelle. While she's step touching, having to think about what body part you'd like to work on. Oh, upper body. Upper or lower, it doesn't matter. The choice is yours. All right, deltoid. Deltoid, yeah, we can do this one. Pick the exercise, fantastic. So we're doing some shoulder work right now. Michelle's choice has been shoulders. We're working right into medial deltoid. We're also doing some cardiovascular work by doing our step touch. I'll just sort of stop and breathe for a second. Hang on. Okay, keep going. Working those shoulders, squeezing up and down. Feel the shoulders contracting. Now I'm going to keep going with the shoulder exercise, a simple variation. Still working medial deltoid, overhead press. Lift and pull, lift and pull, taking the hands higher. For some people, this is just a little bit difficult. If you don't like doing that one, go back down to the lower exercise that Michelle chose before. But you're still pumping those shoulders nice and strong. Eight, seven, six, five. Get ready, we're going to go back to our grapevine move. Take it to the left. In, out, and down. Keep those grapevines going, well done. In, out. And down to the left and the right. It's a little holding pad. We've worked the shoulders a lot. We've got the lateral raises, the upright rows. Take me back to single step touch now. Reach and pull. Keep the step touch going. Who have I got now? Jody, Jody, Jody. What body part would you like to work? Shoulders. How about rear shoulders? The back of the shoulders. Fantastic. You got an exercise? Okay. Squeezing. That's it. If you really focus on squeezing your arms back, we've slowed our rhythm down, which is great. And you're focusing rear deltoid. Squeeze into the back of the shoulders. This is a good one for your posture as well. Help you to think like really tall and for your back. Getting your rhomboids, the back of the shoulders, a little bit of lat. Definitely getting the middle of the shoulders too, that isometric contraction. Holding your arms up. And we're still tip, tip touching. Step touching is what I'm trying to say. Squeeze it through. Go back to your overhead press. Take it up and down. Up, down, up, down. Fantastic. Lots and lots of shoulders. Four, three. How about a side raise now? Lateral raises. Out and in, out and in. So we've gone back to Michelle's exercise. Work through Jody's exercises. Keep that going. Eight to go. I'm going to make my way to my place. Then we're going back to our holding pattern. And remember the holding pattern was the grapevine combo. Arms low to start. In, out and down. Take it to the right. Take it to the left. Keep the arms going. Now remember the arm line changed a little bit. Next time take it overhead. That's sort of combining Michelle's exercise there. Pushing up overhead. In, squeeze and lift. Two more times, step it out. One more time the same, go back to single step touches. Out and in, keep that one going, don't stop. While I pop down the back. Janie, 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 upper body or lower body? Well, let's do lower body. Let's do lower body, you've done a lot of upper. Yeah. How about some nice squats, you show me. Fantastic, feet slightly apart, toes straight ahead, chest up nice and high. Working through the arms still a little bit here, they've kept going, but I want you to concentrate into your legs. If your arms are tired, you can keep them down. Focus on lowering and squeezing. When you do a squat exercise, keep your weight in your heels. As you stand up, drive your hips forward. You're really working through your glutes, that's it. Squeeze the arms back. Breathing out, nearly there. Let's increase the intensity on this one. Three pulses down this time, let's go. Down, three, and two, and one. Try it again, down, three, two, one. Two more times the same. Three, two, one. One more time, three, two, Back to your single squats. Keep going, guys. Down and up. Down. They're doing really well so far. We've had upper body and lower body. Nearly there. Finish your set. 
Four more times the same, sit it down low. Four, lift. Three, don't forget to squeeze in the shoulder blades. Please take me back to single step, touch right and left now. Out in, out in, that's it, relaxing through the knees. Keeping your heart rate up a little bit, burning those calories. Great vine arms down low, curl it in, out, and down. Catching your breathing here, relaxing through the shoulders. Take the arm line even higher now. Reach it in, push up. Remember you've got hand weights, so you can't wave your hands around. You've got to control those weights. Squeeze them up, four more. Breathe out four, breathe out three. Keep it moving, and guess what? We're coming back to step touches. You've got to wait just a little bit longer to catch up what Effie's exercise is going to be. So you come back now, you hear? Woo! Don't forget during the break, just take a moment to kind of loosen off your grip, loosen off your hand, both sides. Stretch it out. Wave, hi mom, hi dad, all of those things. All right, take me back to a step touch, right and left, here we go. Out in, out in, keep the arms moving. We've got to go straight over to Effie and find out which is her exercise right now. What did you want to do? Lower body. Lower body, fantastic. Same leg? Oh, we're going to lunge forward and back. Forward, give the arms a rest. Just concentrate, yes, that was a definite yes. We're going to concentrate on this one. In fact, I need to concentrate. I'm getting the wobbles. Balancing. Very important to balance. In fact, I should stop talking and concentrate on balancing. But no, I'm not allowed to. I'm being paid to keep talking and balance and do my lunges and smile all at the same time. How are we going? I'm getting... I can't, do, I can't turn my head around and do this one. Other leg. Ready? Let's go. Left leg. Let's see if I have better luck on this side. Down. No, no. I don't have better luck on this side. I think it's because I'm standing half on a mat. That'll be my excuse. Let's try that. Is it better? It's better. That's it. Down and lift. Brace your stomach muscles. I've got to do all the things I keep telling you to do. And down. This is a tough exercise. Down. Let's go back to step touches right and left. Thanks, Effie. That's great. All right. So we've had a nice combination of exercises. Step touches side to side. Reach and pull. Eight more. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Let's go back to our holding pattern. Remember the grapevine with the arms down nice and low. Curl it in, out. And down. In, out. Do it again. Reach and pull. Take the arms a little bit higher this time. Stretch it up. Reach and stretch. Don't stop moving those arms. That's it. Back down to step touches. Reach and pull. Okay, the first exercise we had was Michelle's exercise. Remember she was working into her shoulders. Keep the step touch going. Lateral raises. Out to the side. Lifting and squeezing the muscle right here. Right here through your shoulder. Squeeze it. Eight more. Eight, seven, soft knees. Four to go. Four, we change it now. We're going into an overhead press. Take it up. Lift, lift, lift. Still working Michelle's muscle group, the shoulders. Then we go into Jody's exercise, which was take it back, forward. Still working the shoulders. We're working a little bit more into rear deltoid. You've really got to focus on squeezing your shoulder blades together, opening it out. Keep the hands just a little bit below shoulder level. Squeeze that through. Okay, feet apart. Squat down and lift. Now you can work with or without the arms. Going out and pull. Janie's exercise, that's it. Working the squats into the lower body. Two more. One more time. Now down for three pulses. Increase your intensity. Three and two and one and up. Three and two. Two more times, exactly the same. Down three, two. One, one last time. Take it down. Get ready for the right leg. Lunging. I've really got to concentrate this time. Lunging forward and back. This is Effie's choice. You know, whenever we do these sort of things, Effie always chooses the hardest exercise. You can understand now why she has such a muscular and strong body, because she always works hard. The only way you're going to achieve those sort of results is working hard. And lift. One time back. Change legs now. Left side. Forward. Together back together. Brace your abdominals, work it strongly and lift. Keep your focus, that's it. Transfer the weight. Down and up. Nearly there. Step touch, right and left now. Out and you've survived that section, you've done well. Keep that moving. Back to the holding pattern with the grapevine. Arms going in out, in out. Control down. Remember to smoothly move those arms. Don't throw them around. Take the arms higher now. Breathe out when you push up. Woo! Push it up. 
That's it. Squeeze and lift. Four more times the same. Stepping out with the heel down first. And three. Press it through. Two. Last time, single step touch. Out and in. Out. As you reach through, remember to squeeze between the shoulder blades. Keep those feet moving. Eight more. Great big steps. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Now, I don't know how much time we've got left. We're going to try and keep going all the way through Michelle's exercise first. Out and down. Try and remember them all. That's it. Pushing and lifting. We change the variation. Take your overhead press. Pushing down. Four more times the same. Four. Three. Into Jody's exercise. Back. Forward. Back. Forward. Do you know what muscle group? Back of the shoulders. Feet apart. Janie squats. Down. Lift. Down. Lift. Squeeze the hips through. Take three pulses now. Down. Three. Two. One. You drive those hips forward. Okay, feet together, lunging, Effie's exercise. Forward and back. Keep your focus now, that's it. If you wanted to add arms, you could do bicep curls. Just keep them going. Down, one more on this leg. Take it back, change sides. We've done well, forward and back. Keep the control. Make sure you're pulling your stomach muscles in tight. Nearly there. Guess what, we managed to get through everything two times from the top. It feels good. Just keep your feet step touching on the spot. We're going to come straight back up to this break with some stretches. Well deserved stretches. See you soon. It's amazing how a slow, controlled workout, I mean, we didn't really do lots of high intensity running and jumping, but we were all huffing and puffing and sweating definitely in that one. It's nice to focus on specific areas in the body. Now the first area that we focused on, the shoulders, so let's give those a little bit of a stretch now. Posture tucked under, take your arm all the way across and continue to pull that one. So we're stretching actually, it's actually Jody's area first because it's the back of the shoulder that we're doing first of all. Change it around, pull that across the other side. Maintain really good posture the whole way, keep the chest up. Now to stretch the front of your shoulders, take your hands back back that way. If you want to, you can link your fingers up, lift your chest, squeeze the shoulder blades and even take the arms higher. Get a great stretch into the front of the shoulders and relax. Now to get the trapezius and a little bit more shoulder, arm across, head over to the side, lengthen out the neck, that's it, and slowly change that around to the other side. Pull the arm across, drop the head over. You're dropping the ear down towards your shoulder now, just relaxing in that position. Loosen the shoulders and three, that's two. Now, next area we work, what do we do? Oh, I know. We kind of did the bottoms, the quads, the hamstrings, and all those squats and lunges. So start off standing on one leg, pulling your knee back. Now, I know this exercise is actually hard for some people. They've got sort of dodgy knees and things. If you have an uncomfortable position like this, maybe you could just try doing the hip flexor stretch, pushing forward, and you'll get a bit of lengthening there. Whichever one's best for you. That's it. Change it over to the other side. Gradually pulling back. Pull your knee back a little bit. Tuck your pelvis under. Concentrate on that form, that's it. Again, we're working on the balancing. Now, it's, I'm not having trouble with Effie's exercise. It's just like, I couldn't get my act together. But now I've got the hang of the balancing thing, finally. That's it, the knee coming back. All right, hamstring. Foot forward, toes up, pushing your bottom back. How about changing the stretch just a little bit by pointing your toes? Extend that down and take your chest just a little bit further forward. Pushing your bottom back. That's it, release slowly out of that one and change the other side. Toes up. Make sure you bend from your hips, so you push out, the bottom going back, the chest coming forward. And then to change the stretch slightly, take your toes down, take your chest just a little bit further over the top. Increasing the stretch right down the middle of the hamstring area. Okay, now when you do squats and lunges, you're also working your inner thighs, so take the feet out wide. Sitting down, push the knees out to the side and gently stretch through your groin, your inner thigh area. Sitting down nice and low, we're going to hold here for a while. Do you realise the longer you hold onto the stretches, the more benefit you get? Because usually after about 10 seconds, you actually start to relax and breathe and just increase the stretch a little bit more. So hang in with them just that little bit longer. Hands above the knees, roll yourself up. And one of the best sort of bottom stretches I know, we actually got to sit down on the ground. So join me down on the floor, sitting yourself down, one leg bent, other foot over the top. And you're going to grab that leg and sit up tall. And do a great stretch right down here on your bottom, lifting up really high. 
Remember to relax your breathing. So try not to tense these muscles up. You've got to relax your shoulders. Relax your body. You're still lifting up good posture, but don't lift your shoulders. Relax the neck. A bit of rotation. Hand down. Arm coming across. Look right over your shoulder. Continue to stretch. Looking around. Hello, world. How are you today? Have you had a good day? Oh, around the other side now. Change it across. Drop the bottom down. Wrapping your arm around, lifting up. Do you realise that this show, it goes all around the world. So you could be watching this show. It might be morning for you or evening for other people around the world. All across the world. We're going across Australia, Asia, Europe, America, Britain, out in the middle of the ocean. I know on the oil rigs. Hi, guys, that are working on all of those things there. Through the rotation. Come right around the corner. So we are all across the world. In fact, we've had lots of people coming past today. We've met some people from Holland and some people from Perth in Western Australia, all across the world. So a big hello to all of you, wherever you are, and I hope you join us for the very next Aerobics Oz style. Bye for now.